everybody and welcome back to um, my first day of the week of my six day week it's Sunday and this is week five so um, just gonna get right into um, you're knowing me by now I'm in the mornings I run late because I am definitely a night owl so I take my time in the morning <laughs> I run late okay so um, I've decided since I'm working my six out or my six day weeks that on on Sundays I would give you first impression on Saturday the end of the week I will give you my final thoughts on everything my allergies are nuts this week just nuts but it is so hot here it's like a, a hundred it feels like a hundred and ten in the shade that's what they're saying it feels like a hundred and ten so anyway let's get started my brows are definitely dark this week <laughs> first impression I'm gonna have to get used to it it's too dark very wet formula this is Kardashian Beauty and I have no glasses on tamer. and I'm pretty sure that this is in medium to dark <laughs> sorry if I'm sniffling I'm really sorry but anyway, um, this is the spoolie for it, and it is ver a very wet formula. So when I use my, my spoolie to tame things out after I put things on, then it really all goes to the end. So I have to wipe this off a lot. It's very wet, and it's very dark. I'm going to have to get used to it. Um, I, I'm so used to the lighter stuff because it was never very dark. This here matches my my eyes, or not my eyes, my, my hair, but it just seems very dark for me. So tell me what you think, okay? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, the next is, I used, I'm going to put that away. Then I used my um, Ulta Eye Primer, which you guys know I absolutely love this, and I'm using it up, so I'm using it every single week until it's gone. Then, uh, for my uh, for my eyes this week, I'm using my chocolate bar. I just, I love this palette, but I just don't use it often enough. So anyway, this week I used my, this one here, whoops, this, this here I will probably use all week. Nope, not that, this one. This one here is the shimmery one. This one here is the matte. I will use that all over my my uh, lid um, all week long, probably. Then I used this in my transition and this for my lid color. So I used this, this, and this for today. And I will show you. That is definitely dark on my lids, that's for darn sure. Having a dark eye day. But, you know, I work in a bar, so it's dark anyway. <laughs> anyway, I use, and goes on very well. Very well, not very powdery. I love it. This is one of my absolute favorite palettes. My next is my favorite mascara, which is the Perversion Mascara. And this is just a sample I got with a palette that I'll use later on. And this is what that looks like. I love this spoolie. It just goes on. It's so soft and it just goes on so nice. I, I love this mascara. Okay, next is I'm going to use my Ulta uh, Blush in... Peony. And that's what that looks like. It's got a little bit of sparkle in it. I try to use some of these blushes that I don't use often enough. And then for my highlighter, oh darn it, I am using my Ulta Illuminating Pow Powder in Pink Diamond. And that's what that looks like. I don't hardly ever use this either. So that is my highlighter, and I have it down my nose, and I have a little bit of a, too big of a stripe down my nose, I think. Ah! 
for lips this week I'm going to use the Ulta minis that I got in a kit um, this last fall and this is and it is the Moxie lipsticks um, live large and this is what that looks like which is a little dark I gotta say I might have to pat a couple of times because the more I look at it the darker it is and I don't know but like I said I hate doing that with the tissue because then you get little tissuey stuff all over. But that did calm it down just a little bit. Anyway, I work in a bar, so who cares if I have red lipstick on? You know, it's not like I'm going to an office every day where I'd be worried about, you know, it being too dark. Um, so anyway, I'm going to wear whatever lipsticks I want to wear from now on. It'll just be my thing, I guess, huh? So, um, it's very creamy, goes on very well, not patchy whatsoever. Um, I really like those little lipsticks. I just don't use them often enough, so I need to get them in my rotation. So I will probably use them, you know. So anyway, off to work I go. I will talk to you tomorrow in day two. Good morning. Welcome bye -bye. back to my day two of my week for... Um, making a work series <laughs> I am um, opening today well I opened Saturday by myself to a different bar but today is my first day of opening by myself to um, my regular bar which I work at five days a week so I'm kind of excited anyway um, let's get right into the makeup because this is gonna be a long one because it's six days okay so and I have my hair is not tucked in right. Okay, using my Kardashian Beauty for my brows. Using my um, Perversion Mascara. Using my, this is not in any order, my um, Ulta Illuminizer in Pink Diamond. My Ulta Mineral Blush in Peony. my Ulta eye primer. This week I'm using my chocolate bar palette and I am using this color for all over my eyes. Today I used this in my uh, crease and tra for transition and I used yeah this one and then I used the gold on my lids today. Um, I like shimmery lids but matte transition or crease color okay show you my eyes my cheeks and for the lipstick today I'm using it's Urban Decay it's a kit I got um, last fall sometime uh, with lots of little mini lipsticks and this is their Moxies and this is Rise Up and they come in, you know, some of them come in little black packages, some of them come in the gold. And this one is what this looks like. And it almost looks, it's pretty shiny, so it's like, um, almost like a metallic is the way it looks. It's, it's really kind of pretty. But it's a nude, nudie brown, I would say. So there we go with that. The last step I have to do, I haven't done yet is my finishing spray and I'm gonna use I'm gonna try to see if this helps me because I sweat most of my makeup off during the day because I'm in a hot kitchen part of the day so this is the NYX matte finish uh, long-lasting setting spray and let's try this Woo. smells good doesn't smell bad all right, guys, that is it for my Tuesday. I'll see you tomorrow, which is Wednesday. Bye-bye. everybody, and happy Wednesday. And here I am with my makeup of the day. Um, let's get started. I'm trying to make this a little bit shorter this week because it's a long week. Okay, my things that I'm wearing all week long, and I'm just grabbing without 
you know, no particular order, is the Ulta Illuminating Powder in Pink Diamond, the Ulta Blush in Peony, the um, Ulta Eye Primer, Ulta theme this week it looks like, Kardashian Beauty uh, Brow Management Gel, and my Perversion Mascara by Urban Decay. Um, my eyeshadow this week is by um, Too Faced Chocolate Bar. Smells just as good every time you or you open it. Um, wearing this, I've worn this all week long as the base. I'm. This is the second day in a row I've used this because um, I really like this um, for transition shade. And today I am wearing this color for my my lid color. Let me show you my eyes. So pretty that that lid color. And for lipstick today, this week I'm wearing Urban Decay's um, little minis that I got last fall. And this color, and they're in the Moxie formula, and it's uh, Make Your Move. And this one is in the little black with gold. This is what it looks like. So pretty. It is really a pretty color. I really like this The day, one. except for my setting spray, and I'm going to do that right now. I seem to forget to do that until I'm on camera, so... All right. Whew. Smells good. And I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Hey everybody, Bye. happy Thursday. Thursday, yes. <laughs> I have to stop and think, you know, my days kind of run together. So anyway, um, this is day four of my work week. And let's get started. I'm going to show you everything that I use during the week first. And that is the Ulta Eye Primer, the Kardashian Beauty Brow Management Gel, the Perversion Mascara by Urban Decay, the Ulta Illuminating Powder in Pink Diamond, the Ulta Minerals Blush in Peony, and today for my eyes, I, this week I'm using the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette. Today for my eyes, as usual, I wore this color for my base all over. Then I wore this for my um, transition. I'm kind of going between these two here. No, wait. I used this for my transition. I'm sorry about that. This one and this one I kind of go, go back and forth with. Um, and then I used this for my lid color today. It's really a pretty uh, purpley, rosy, uh, mauve with a little tiny bit of gold sparkles in it. And I just used a really light hand, but then I kind of built it up to where I wanted it. And then for my lips, I used the um, Urban Decay uh, Moxie deluxe sample sizes that I got last fall and this color is Risk It All and this is that and then I patted it once to calm it down just a little bit because I didn't want it quite so in your face it's still pretty dark but anyway there is my makeup look today and it, it's pretty dark um, I must say but like I said I work in a work in a bar so they're not going to notice so much that my eyes are dark you know the makeup is dark or you know and I don't think it's that terribly dark but when I look at it in the mirror it looks pretty dark to me and um and because my eyebrows are so dark too I guess I'm still trying to get used to that and yesterday I thought they looked a little bit better than they do today because I don't know I I used a lighter hand yesterday or something I don't know Anyway, I will see you um, on Friday, which is tomorrow, for day five. Bye-bye. Good morning, everybody. This is Connie, and welcome back to day five. And I am um, in a hurry. <laughs> I need to actually need to get out and move my car. They are, must be paving my, you know, 
uh, black topping my road, <clears throat> my street today. So I need to get out there and do that. But uh, I wanted to do my makeup really quick. Um, let you know what's on my face today. Kardashian Beauty um, brow product. Perversion Mascara. Ulta uh, Blush and Peony. Illu uh, Ulta Illuminating Powder in Pink Diamond. Uh, Chocolate Bar Palette, which I always, I'm in love with. Use this, same as always. I used, used this for my transition shade. And I actually used this really dark, shimmery, glittery purple for my eyelids today. And I used a very light hand, but it's still uh, kind of dark. But, you know, I said I was going to use this palette all week, so that's what I'm doing. And I like I like the, the shimmery, glittery on my eyelids. So, okay, for my lipstick today, I'm using the Moxie Be Brilliant, I think it says. And it's a very shiny, highlighty looking looks like I have gloss on lipstick all right guys that is it for today I will see you tomorrow my last day of the week and I will let you know how I liked everything this week talk to you then bye hi everybody and welcome to day six and the last day of my work week I um, this week went pretty well my schedule is going to be changing again I'm going to get a couple more hours a week but next week it's going to be the same so um, my shirt is not lying right <laughs> so uh, I'll let you know when that does next this coming week is going to be the same so um, I'll let you know when my schedule changes. Okay, let's get started. First of all, the first thing I did was change my phone case. Look at my grumpy little owl. Isn't he cute? And those are flowers, peonies, out of my mother's garden. Or mother's, my mother's peonies that she has grow every year. They're beautiful. They're this looks really pink. They are more of a really deep pink, almost red. Okay. And anyway, my phone case, I changed it from this, which is very cool. It's very cool looking, but it's, it's bulky. If you can see that, it's hard and it's bulky. And I'm kind of used to these soft cases where they're kind of plasticky or, or rubbery feeling. So that's what I like. And this is so much lighter and so much thinner that I'm, I'm really happy with this one. Um, and I got that for review oh, probably a year ago, maybe. Okay, let's start on with the makeup for the week. Because um, I do have to get going here real soon. Kardashian Beauty um, Brow Product. Got to say, I'm not totally thrilled with this. Even if it, it is really, it's dark and it's hard to work with because it's so dark. Um, I thought I wanted something this dark. And it is, it does pretty much match my eyebrows. What do you guys think? You tell me. <clears throat> is it just because I just still have to get used to it? But today, I mean, it's really, it's it's very a, a wet formula, so it smears really easily until it dries. So anyway, that's another part of this that I'm not crazy about. Then I used my Ulta Eye Primer, and you guys know I absolutely love this. I'm using it until it's empty, and then I'll go on to another one. This would be a definite repurchase for me, but I've got a lot of them to use until I would repurchase. Um, my Perversion Mascara. This is my favorite all-time mascara. My absolute favorite. And I just want a full size, so I'm trying to use this this deluxe size up. But look at that. I mean, it's got a huge um, spoolie on it, but I love, love it. It's soft. It's not, it doesn't hurt your eyes. It, <clears throat> it doesn't smear on my eyelids when I'm putting on my mascara. 
it makes my eye my eyelashes look pretty I think um, even though you probably can't tell because I don't have a lot of eyelashes um, I think they look pretty all right so then I used my let's see Ulta um, blush in peony which is just a really pretty pink blush it's got just tiny tiny gold sparkles in it um, not a whole lot but it does have some it is not the most pigmented blush I own for for sure but I don't want a super pigmented blush either um, I think it looks fine on my cheeks next is my Ulta illuminating powder in pink diamond this is very pretty I don't have anything bad to say about this I do normally like the more champagne -y colors um, on my cheeks and this is more a little pink than I'm used to but I still really like it and you know looking in the mirror you can't hardly see it so okay for my I used my chocolate bar which is probably one of my absolute favorite um, eye palettes that I own this was my I am thinking this is my first high-end purchase of a, a palette I think this was my first purchase that I did myself. All right, so this week, I used this all week. I used this, you know, a few days. <clears throat> Excuse me. And you'll probably see every week, you'll probably see me using one or two transition shades every week because there, you know, there's not a lot of matte shades that are good for transitions in these palettes. So, and I absolutely love this color and that's what I'm using today and then I'm using this dark um, really dark brown with sparkles in it today it's got a lot of gold sparkles but it's very dark brown and I'll show you it's I mean I used a very light hand but the only thing is I I mean there are these are pigmented they the color payout is wonderful on all of these and they're not too powdery. They don't they don't kick up a lot of powder. Um, the one thing I must say about their their sparkly eyeshadows, I after I put my my shadows on and stuff, um, I've got a lot of little sparkles on my cheeks. That is the only fallout that I have. There's no color payout. It's just a little a few sparkles. It's not the color of the shadow. So I'm this is still very high top ranking in my book I love this okay and for lipsticks this week I used my Too Faced Too Faced my Urban Decay um, deluxe samples that I got last fall the one I used today was Moxie Get Ready and this is the color here but this is what they look like some of them are black with a little gold Nope, that's plain black. This one's got the um, the gold leaf on it, and then you've got the just plain gold. And these are the ones that I used this week, and they are all the Moxie deluxe samples that I got this last fall. Anyway, that is up. my week in review, and if you love any of the stuff that I use let me know if you don't like any of the stuff that I used let me know tell me your opinions um, tell me your opinions on my looks um, are you bored yet do you want me to switch things up just let me know what you guys want because I'm willing to do what you want um, I won't be doing any get ready with me's you know during the my work week because that would just take way too long these are a half an hour long anyway you know so and I cut them down as much as I possibly can so I will talk to you tomorrow on day one I'm thinking week next week will be week four or week five I am so confused <laughs> next week will be week five talk to you later bye bye